Alright guys, so today we're going to be deconstructing Life is Good by Future and Drake. Before I get into this video, I just want to preface by saying that this was probably one of the hardest beats that I've had to remake. A lot of the synths and the different sounds were just super abstract. It was kind of hard to pinpoint what exactly they did to get certain sounds in the beat. But nonetheless, I think I got pretty close. So we're just going to go and dive right into this track here. Alright guys, so the first thing we're going to do is start working on the chord progression that you hear throughout Drake's part of the track. For this, I'm going to go and go with Serum and actually open a custom design sound that I made to recreate this melody. So that's pretty much the main chord progression of Drake's half of the track. This chord progression is complemented by a counter melody, which is actually kind of interesting. It's this weird, like distorted lead kind of sound. So really quickly, I'm just going to render this out to audio. Now, before we move on to the drums, there's one more sound in this beat that we're going to want to recreate. And that's like some kind of guitar stab pluck, whatever you want to call it. So right here we should have all three of the samples that go into recreating this beat. Now the drums for this track are pretty simple so I'm just going to open up a brand new pattern here. If you need any of these sounds I'll have them linked in my personal drum kit which will be in the comment section as well as the description so you can go ahead and check that out. We're going to go ahead and start off with the hi-hats. Next up, we got our snare and our clap. And then lastly, we can go and throw in the 808. And that's pretty much it for the drums. They're pretty simple. And that is pretty much Drake's half of Life is Good. So we're going to move on to Future's half of Life is Good. And his section is going to be at a BPM of 142. The first thing that we're going to take a look at is going to be pretty much the main melody of the beat. The first step to recreating this is going to be using FL keys. We're going to pencil in some chords. With these chords, we're not going to keep this pattern. We're actually going to bounce it out to an audio file so we can reverse it. That's mainly what we want from that first chord. We're gonna go back into this pattern here and clear this out. And we're gonna pencil in a few more notes for the, the melody that plays alongside the chords. And go ahead and reverse it. So this is pretty much as close as I could get to the main melody in Future's half of Life is Good. Alongside this, there's also a counter melody, which is like a very, very low pitched kind of bell sound. And that's pretty much it for the melodies. So now we can just move straight on over to the drums. Once again, I'll be using all the drums from my personal drum kit. We'll go ahead and load up a clap here. We'll go ahead and throw in our hi-hat pattern.
And then lastly, we can go and throw in the 808 pattern here. And on the second loop over of the beat, uh, there's a snare that comes in. It's just your typical trap snare. As far as the arrangement for this beat goes, it pretty much starts off with the main melody and the drums, and then the counter melody comes in along with the drums, and then pretty much loops out throughout the entire track. But that is pretty much Future's half of Life is Good, and at the end of the video, I'll play both halves in their entirety so you can see how everything came out. Other than that, that is pretty much the deconstruction of Life is Good by Future and Drake. If you guys enjoyed this video, please feel free to leave a like and a comment letting me know what you thought. And if you need any of the drum sounds that you heard in this video, they will be linked in my personal drum kit down in the comments as well as the description below. Other than that, guys, that's pretty much going to be it for me today. So thank you all for watching, and I will see you soon.